Welcome to my project Pasar Patkum. Now we discuss about Fovia Center Reduction based on the retina anatomy and mathematical morobiology. In this process, we analyze the retina color image by using MATLAB image processing. It was used to find the eye diseases and also find Fovia in eye retina area and then classify Fovia in that area. We did the Fovia center reduction based on color eye funds images. The retina anatomy constrains on the relative location of mathematical morobiology and retina structure. The detection of anatomical feature is necessary because of computer aided diagnosis and also several retinal diseases. Our proposed method is adapt to local illumination changes which are robust the local distribution by using pathology in digital eye image. Using grey image, the result of reduction of Fovea center in 37 out of 37 images at also 100 percentage. Using dietic air DDP1 database, the result will be 82 out of 89. The result shows a better performance compared to the previous method. This is the flow diagram for our proposal system. In our proposal system, first we give the input image. The input image is uh, like a retinal image and then it go to the green channel. In the green channel is the pre-processed system. In the pre-processed step, we convert the front image into grey image. Analyze the image which have any noise. If it have the noise, then remove the noise by use Gaussian filter. Because detection of Fourier center is difficult to noisy image. Then generate the histogram equation of pre-processed image. In this method, we convert the image into green channel image by applying the regional minima and the geodetic morobiological to reconstruct the image. It is useful to separate the optic disk and fovea easily. Then the green channel image is go to the optic identification process. In this process, identify the optic disk location using the superior and inferior nasalus arcades that are located in the opposite side of the temporal arcades. Optic disk detection on morobiological technique have two main, two main stages. One is reduction of the optic disk location and another is reduction of the disk boundary. The optic disk location based on the vascular tree after changing green channel we found the optic region and boundary. The optic disk region is useful to detect the boundary also calculate the diameter of the optic disk. If, the, if we find the optic disk, then we go to the ROA image. In ROA image, inside the ROA, the fovea is located, the fovea by anatomical information. In this method, the ROA image has 160 into 160 pixel. ROA image is used to detect the location of fovea. Then, we finish the ROA process, then we go to the smooth ROA. In this process, first we and remove the bright spots and small bends in image by use of Fourier segment. We re because we remove the bright spots because of the detect the Fourier center clearly and accurately. Also remove the all Bayesian which is useful to detect the accurate location. And then something process we map select the Fourier region. After remove the bright spots and small Bayesians, we identify the Fourier region. The identification in is used to detect the particular fovea center. In this image, first we select the region of affecting area. Then we go to the fovea detector. The fovea detector is used to fuzzy see mean clustering method. The algorithm is an iterative clustering method that produces an optimization LC variation phi, minimizing the weighted within group sum of square error objective function. Finally, the segmenting images are classified to the fovea center. This classification is done in ANFIS algorithm.
the adaptive neurophysics interpretation system or ANSYS is useful to classify the images to get the final result. The result will be more accurate than the previous method. The acronymy ANSYS derives its name for adaptive neurophysics interpretation system. Using a given input and output data set, the toolbox function ANSYS constructs a fuzzy interpretation system whose membership function parameters are trained using either a back propagation algorithm along or in combination with a least squares type of method. This adjustment allows your fuzzy system to learn from the data they are modeling. A network type structure similar to that of a neural network which maps input throw input membership function and associated parameter and then throw output members function and associated parameter to output can be used to interpret the input or output map. The parameter associated with the membership functions changes through the learning process. The computation of these parameters is factorated by the gradient vector. This gradient vector provides a measure of how well the fuzzy interpretation system is modeling the input or output data for a given set of parameters. When the gradient vector is obtained, any of several optimization patterns can be applied in order to adjust the parameters to reduce some error measure. This error measure is usually defined by the sum of the square difference between actual and desired outputs. And this is uses either back propagation or combination of lead square estimation and back propagation for membership function parameter estimation. In fuzzy system, it will classify the feature by using some several rules. That rules will help to classify the data will be a normal or severe type or moderate type. Now I am going to demo of the proposal system. First open the MATLAB and then right click the m1.m file and run that file and then the process guide will be opened. First we will load the input image from data set. We will load one image. It is the retinal base image. It is the gistogram of the original image. It is the given input image. Then we go to the green channel process. It is the histogram equation of preprocessed image. It is used to find the Fourier center and, opt and optic center. And it is the green channel of the original input image. And then we go to detect the optic disk edges. And it is the optic disk edges. It is used to find the Fourier on the retinal base image. Then we go to the ROI or region of center stars. We go to nearest to the Fourier. And then we detect the fovea from the ROI image, it is the fovea. Then analyze that fovea for it is the affected the retinal by normal level, normal level or moderate level or severe level. Then we go to the analysis process, it takes few minutes for analyzing the image. The waiting bar will be open. And then the given image is the normal. Now we go to load the another image from data set then the same process will be again and we find the green channel value and then after disk and go to the original contrast and track the fovea and analyze the fovea and that fovea is affected at severe level in the retinal and if we go to eject the window then go to click the close button for close the guide and the process will be finished thanks for watching video